Hi Flat Earthers, I have an idea for an experiment to prove that this is a more accurate map than the globe map or a square map. Do you remember this experiment by Paul on the plane using his iPhone to prove that the earth is not spinning? Or do you remember this experiment by Rannick with his iPhone where he explained how the accelerometer works? And why when you tilt your phone the image automatically orients itself? And how you can record all the movements on the X, Y, and Z axis? He explained that gravity does not have an effect on the gyroscope. It's the reason why airplanes can fly. Well, I have an idea how to use the iPhone as well. Let me explain. Remember that southern destination to southern destination flights make strange stopovers. For example, Perth, Australia to Johannesburg, South Africa makes a stopover in Dubai, Hong Kong, or Malaysia. These stopover destinations look like almost straight lines on a flat map. from Johannesburg, South Africa to Santiago, Chile makes a stop over in Senegal on a flat map it's also a straight line And the flight from Johannesburg to Sao Paulo, Brazil makes a stop over in London. Santiago, Chile to Sydney, Australia. has a stopover in Los Angeles. On a flat map, it's also a straight line. There's a big difference between an acute angle and an obtuse one, wouldn't you agree? The acute angle, as in this destination, or an obtuse one that these same flights take on a flat map. There's also a big difference between a right angle and a straight line, right? Right angle, straight line. Here's another angle and a straight line. All we need to do is take a plane flight. And take accelerometer readings while in flight of the XY axis instead of the Z axis then mathematically prove whether the plane is making angle turns 
or is taking a straight path. Just as Rannick described in his video. We would need to check the takeoff and landing directions of the airport. That's easy. We can just check that online. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.